presentation. I'm Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony and Richard Jefferson alongside. David Aldridge is with us from the floor tonight. Hey, Dave. Well, thank you very much. Now, the NBA has accepted that this is an era of player movement. Commissioner Adam Silver says the data shows that superstars moving isn't... It always does. It keeps the fans involved and looking for more. David, thanks. Now the starting group for the visitors. And for the Lakers, we've got Rudy Fernandez. Miracic is out there with Hernan Gomez. Then it's Ricky Rubio. And it's Hernan Gomez in at the three, the small forward. RJ, I remember it clearly when LeBron James joined the Lakers back in 2018. Yeah, I remember it too because everyone kept asking me where he was going. I didn't know, but this is year five for LeBron in L.A. And obviously, even with that 2020 title, this town, they ask for more. And three of these years have been rookie, two of the times missing the postseason in a first-round exit, the first one of LeBron's career. Yeah, LeBron is not used to that at all. He's not playing in the postseason. Nope. Here are the Lakers. Knocked away. Passes to Fernandez. Shots good by Rene Gomez. Rene Gomez has got his second bucket tonight. Boy, he is looking confident. Love how they're using him so far. Yeah, when he gets engaged this early in the game, it's bad news for the defense. He can roll this start throughout the rest of the game. And savvy inside play by Clarkson, getting himself a look right at the basket. Hernan Gomez passes to Rubio. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Easy possessions like that literally are just a gift. You just dream of them. He'll gladly take those. Lakers have gotten their first three shots to go in for him to start off this game. Here's the pass to Hernan Gomez. High post try, Hernan Gomez. Great positioning on the putback. Out. Out to a hot start. Four makes and five shots to begin this ball game. Hernan Gomez covering. Here's Ramos. Herman Gomez grabs the miss. Hernan Gomez has got four rebounds in this game. Inside. And there's Miritich on the assist by Fernandez. But not hard to see why they are giving up points on this one. Just too many good looks from in close. Rubio with a wide open look. And he can't extend the lead to double digits. Hard to believe Greg last season. LeBron missing the playoffs for just the third time in his career. And Kevin, it, it almost felt surreal to not have him in the playoffs. I mean, this guy's been a fixture in the postseason for almost two decades now. Just another bullet on LeBron's incredible resume. Here's Hernan Gomez. Misses the layup. He had him with that bump fake. Pass to Ramos. There's the drive. There's the killer two-handed slam. Straight power, homie. I mean, he ripped it down <laughs> with both hands. Absolutely a resounding dunk. Out left to the wing. Hernan Gomez in the corner. And again, the Lakers, no good. And the defense was all over him once he got in close. Didn't want him to get too comfortable. Clarkson passes to Ramos. It's tipped. Uh, you know, some people could say he's struggling on offense this period. I like to think of more of his rounding. Just can't seem to find his confidence. And now, let's take a look again at that incredible rejection. And making a statement right away. Letting them know they won't nice. get the nice. easy ones when he's around. Right. Huey's check in for the Lakers. And while it's still very early in the season, the top teams, Greg, have already started to distinguish themselves across the NBA. Getting off to a hot start, always a good sign. But, but don't sleep on the teams that are still getting locked in. A lot can change in the coming months. Now, here's Clarkson. He's tightly guarded. Yep, it counts. Yeah, another nice bucket down low. They've really been able to work the ball into the post effectively here so far. Count it. Yeah. And Gomez has got eight. Nice pass there to set that basket up. Gone four for nine from the field to start this game off. And it's the Lakers on the break. And finished off by Hernan Gomez. 
Well, they weren't yeah. going to pass up that chance to get out and run following the steal. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. And Mark Ian can give you, Greg, a solid defensive effort at both the three and the four. Hey, Kevin, many thought Markinen was a defensive liability, but given credit, worked hard to prove he wasn't. And while not a superb defender, he has become a plus defender for this team. And finish off by Hernan Gomez. Nothing soft about the putback there. And why chance it, right? Take the dunk if you've got it. And that's his MOB physical. Get in position for the putback and throw it down. The defense got to know that's what he's looking to do. Just doing the job on the backboard. Just about an even 40% to start. And it's the Lakers on the break. Punches the three. He can't get that one. Clarkson for three. Kept alive. Oh, great timing. He is one tough customer on that offensive line. It's like he has a sixth sense of where that rebound is going right now. And guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for Los Angeles? Looking at Los Angeles, they took the win in their last game against the Kings in Sacramento. Herman Gomez grabs the miss. Fantastic defense, giving full effort. And finished off by Miritich. The knee just kind of stepping aside and letting him get to the rim. There's a reason, G.A., the lead is what it is right now. Yeah, it's going to take better rim protection than that if they're going to climb out of this hole. And the latest now from our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David, it's all yours. Take it away. Thanks very much. The Lakers are, of course, one of the league's story franchises. And Magic Johnson was asked recently if they have the best all-time collection of players. He says it's not even close. Outside of Bill, we have all the dominant closers. Kobe, Jerry, LeBron now, Irving. Come on now, it's just too many Lakers. Kevin, back to you. <laughs> well, he, he's got a point, David, and we thank you for your report. Here's Miritich. Goes back up, Hernan Gomez. And it's blocked. Here's the break. Here's Clarkson. Rebound the Lakers. And Gomez has got nine rebounds in the game. Getting it done. Again, the miss by the Lakers. Here's Parks. Solid play in the low block, and that one's good. Yeah, and we always talk about making your teammate better. That assist was right on target. The wide open shot from Hernan Gomez. And that shot misses everything. Air ball on the three. And he uses the glass on the lane. Not just a score. Clarkson is very willing to dish it when a teammate's open. Here's Huey. The lead pass was put in just the right spot. Huey's got his first points of the night. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. And there's the block. Just stops it cold and takes possession. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Hernan Gomez has got rebound number 11 for him here tonight. Oh, that's blocked. To the wing right side. That's his second foul here pretty early in this one. He's got to be careful for the rest of this half. Ricky Rubio checked in for you. Coming under the floor for your Lakers. Lakers lead by seven. It's tipped. And here we go. Jumps up, and he caps off the fast break with a monster slam. Gotta take care of the ball. They'll punish you uh -huh. if you're that careless. That's right, and that's severe punishment right there. An important two points, not just on the scoreboard, but also for a little bit of momentum. Away team. Wow. The Lakers making a switch here. Rounds checked in. Third team foul. Coming under the floor for your Lakers. Brown. Three minutes of action so far in the second quarter. Gone three of eight from the field since the beginning of the second quarter. Here's Parks. A shot off that time. And it's the Lakers the other way. Their biggest lead of the game was nine. The Lakers have had two chances at the line already, making them both. Definitely an area where they can improve. Only 73% as a team from the line last year. 
and he sinks the second. In your younger days, RJ, you had seasons where you averaged over 22 points a game. Some players uh, later in their careers struggle yeah, accepting smaller roles, yeah. different roles. Uh, okay, as a player, go. talk about that challenge. Self-confidence is a weird one. Sometimes it can work great for you, and sometimes it can work against you. For me personally, as I got older, I loved finding the challenge, and the challenge was how could I star in my role? Was it as a 10-point-a-game score? Was it as a 20-point-a-game score? Or was it as a 5-point-a-game score? Because ultimately, you have a chance to have an impact on the game, and I love basketball, so I was going to take any role you were going to give me. What a great answer. You. So in other words, you've always got to evolve. You always get to evolve, and it's always going to be adapt or die, especially as you get older. You have to adapt or your career is going to end. I would have never played 17 years if I didn't adapt. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. And finish off by Hernan Gomez. He's going to put that one in his scrapbook. Insane dunk. And now they're starting to rub it in. Build up a lead, and here we go, baby. It is showtime. Got a hand on it. There's 38 seconds left to play here in the second quarter. Even with a big goose egg by his name on the shot chart, the team is somehow managing just for that. And you can see he just didn't get squared up with his feet. And the Lakers making a change here. Aldama's checked in. That is good in the Los Angeles leads. Cut down to just six points and the bucket from Clarkson. Oh, slick move by Clarkson. Getting around that inside contact to finish the shot. Vernon Gomez covering. Pass to the Beast. Three seconds left. That shot off. And so we conclude the first half. The Lakers on top were discussed during the half. You look at Willie Hernan Gomez. What a contribution. Well, with a double-double in hand through two quarters, you can just imagine what his stat line will look like at the end of this one. But I don't think that that's the most important thing to him. Sure, putting up big numbers doesn't hurt, but he's all about getting the win over everything else. We've got Miritic. Ricky Rubio is out there with Rudy Fernandez. Then there's Hernan Gomez, and it's Hernan Gomez in at the small forward position. That's the Laker five. The Lakers moving the ball around. Rubio in the corner. Always going up for the alley-oop here. Left side, Clarkson. On the left block, and he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. No question, he got bumped on that shot. That free throw, no good. And he's good on the second. About one minute played here in the second half. Here's Miritic, and contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Oh, the officials are all over them. He's made one and missed one so far in the game. And so Miritic nails both of them. On one of three since starting the second half. Here's Clarkson, and he goes in Jordan for the dunk. And sometimes we forget about Clarkson's vertical. He's more than happy to remind us on those throwdowns. Fernandez, that's good. How many times have we seen a possession like that from them today? Ending with a basket, coming off a pretty pass. Hernan Gomez covering, passes it to Aguilar. Second chance shot, and it's good on the layup. He has seven. Second chance points always hurt. Just not enough effort to block out. Yeah, I'm going to go out on a limb here and say they need to emphasize rebounding going forward. On Gomez down low. Another shot. No good from Hernan Gomez. That's one for their first four to start the second half. There it is, guys. One of those effort plays that makes a big difference in the game. And GA is definitely making a difference so far today. Offensive rebounding is about hustle and determination. Huge putback, making a statement there. Richard, you were part of a Cavs team that came back from three games to one down in the NBA Finals to win the title. Remarkable. Just how hard was that to do? 
Well, let me say this. I think it was the greatest championship ever. And I'm not being biased. Those are the facts. They were the defending champion. They had the two-time MVP. Oh, they won 73 wins that year. So for me, that was the most That's special the comeback the because we played in the greatest championship of all time. I'm assuming there was no doubt in your mind at all you wouldn't come back, correct? Uh, that's a lie. Uh, there was tons of doubt in my mind, but I will say this. When you have a group of guys that stay together, when you're down 3-1, it's because you believe in each other and you believe in yourself. No good on the quick three. Uh, I'm shocked that didn't turn into three points. I mean, he makes you pay on those nearly every time. Hey, guys, the D has to show a little more fight on the interior than they did on that trip. The pass to Fernandez. And Miritic gets to you. The Lakers making a switch here. Aldama's checked in. Second team. Lost to Abrinas. Coming in the ball here. Six to shoot. Here is Fernandez. He's covered by Clarkson. Gotten five of eight shots to fall for them in the third quarter. A nice 62% from the field. Fernandez with the rebound. There wasn't a lot of resistance there at that rim. He just, he just tricked off a little bunny. And those plays can make a difference in a game like this. <laughs> well, you know it's going to fire up, Greg, everybody on that bench. If you can feel the jolt of energy that he sent through his team, that is a huge boost in a tight game like this. Part of what makes Clarkson a threat on every possession, he can do it inside, outside, anywhere on the floor. Brown is checked in for Los Angeles. Here's Ewing, and he goes up strong with one hand and flushes it down. Just the kind of play they need in a game this close. You know, that's the kind of aggression they want from their floor leader. No doubt. That's the kind of play that can energize the whole team, and they will take it in a close game like this. They get it back, and it's in there. He's got 11. Ooh, he's on a bit of a heater now. He hasn't missed one this quarter yet. And that's a foul oh, called on the Beast. So that will be his second foul of the game. We're in the bonus. We'll go to the line to shoot two. And let's get your take, guys, on the scoring breakdown for the Lakers. And he makes the first. We're still waiting for that first miss from the line of this half. He hits both from the strike. Gone a solid 6 of 11 when shooting here in the third quarter. Makes it off the glass. Makes up for a lack of speed with just tremendous effort and hustle on that play. And Huey kicks to Abrinas. Poked away. 30 seconds left to play in the third. And there's the drive. Here's Aldama. It's deflected. The dish to Clarkson. For the tie. Out of bounds. The Lakers will take possession. Los Angeles ball. And that kind of stifling effort on defense needs another look. And boy, did he get up quick to reject that shot. That's as fundamental as defense gets. It's still anybody's game as we reach the end of three. Lakers lead by three. And we're just moments away from the start of the fourth quarter. Is it just as much as the accuracy? Not many players can even spot that back. And I know I speak for all of us when I say I can't wait to see what kind of finish awaits us here in the fourth quarter. And we talk about the importance of versatility. He's really got it all on the offensive end. Up again. It's good on the putback. And, folks, he did not luck into that one. He knew just where he wanted to be to grab that backboard. And Miracic throws it down. And just tacks a few more points onto their lead with the tomahawk. That's bringing it down hard. And giving up some inches inside, but makes up for it with an aggressive stop. Yeah, you can give up some size, but that shows you how fearless he is, willing to attack the basket no matter who is in front of him. No good that time. 
And the activity he shows around the rim it is why he is such a respected defender. Yeah, you can see why he's established that reputation. Strong understanding of how to defend at the rim. To tie it up. Lakers with the rebound. Oh, Their biggest lead of the game was not. And he has to take that long, slow walk back to the bench here. He'll watch the rest of this one from the side of the team. Lakers lead by three. And that's a foul called on the Beast. That's his third foul of the game. Rain Man checked in for the Beast. Second team foul. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Rain Man. That's his first foul. And the next one puts him in the bonus. Personal foul. Third team foul. And the Lakers have possession. Fernandez from outside. And imagine how good they'll look if he can start to chip in a bit more offensively. You know what? They're winning, though, despite the fact that he has just been really off. Pass to Clarkson. Puts up a three. Clarkson missing again. Got to find easier shots when you're already oh, struggling. Team. That's uh, not going to get it. Number 13. That's his second personal foul. The fourth team foul. We're about two minutes into the fourth quarter in this one. Offensive rebound. A bigger guard. Clarkson can match up with multiple positions, and he's improved his consistency at that end. And Miricic sends it back. The second chance effort. Shot is good in the Los Angeles lead. It's cut to just one on the basket from Clarkson. Second chance points have really been an issue here defensively. Miracic gets the bucket. He finds a shooter in motion and is confident he can threaten with the lead pass. You look at Willie Hernan Gomez. What a contribution. He's been on an absolute tear inside. They've got to figure out a way to keep him out of the lane. I don't know. Let's check in with our reporter, David Aldrich. Hey, guys. Well, during the break, I was able to catch the message the visiting team coach gave to his team. He told his guys the inside game is working, so stick with it. He's posting, slashing, getting to the rim, whatever produces these high percentage looks. Kevin, back to you. Thank you, David. Aguiar passes to Clarkson. Uses the glass to finish the lane. Clarkson's got 12 points in just the second half. And how about the confidence of Clarkson? This man believes in his abilities. And boy, this team sure believes in him. Now, I understand that that shot didn't go down, but they will take that look every trip down the floor. And it's Rain Man missing. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. Sure, they'll think twice about shooting against him next time. Oh, Kevin, not a Petty, not a Manny, but a face. Oh, bounce to the outs, Greg, yeah. Showing off the bunny. Fernandez from outside. The shot will not fall. Gone over 3 so far in the fourth quarter from long range. And he makes that one. And you want him taking big shots for you in big moments. That one was as easy as it gets. Yeah, it's clear why they go to him in these moments. They know he's going to deliver for him. Yeah, he, he's shown terrific control of the pace and the rhythm of this offense. He's locked in with his teammates right now, setting guys up in perfect position. Rain Man passes to Clarkson. Money! And what a sensational bucket to bring them within one. Oh, you just love seeing a player with absolutely no fear. He knew what they needed here and was determined to deliver. And he had more than enough room there for one of those trademark slams that he's become noted for. And, and Greg, I think once he got that space, he just knew it was going to happen. So did the defense. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Yeah, everybody in the building was waiting for it. So it's Rubio bringing it up for the Lakers. Their biggest lead of the game was not. That's his second personal foul. He drops the first one, and that gives them a four-point cushion. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a five-point game. And I don't need to tell you guys, those free throws are big two-possession game. Rain Man. From outside, off the mark. And so they foul intentionally. Jordan Clarkson. That's his first. He hits the first one, and that increases their lead to six. 
The second one is good. We both at the line. It's a seven-point game. He knows how important it is converting at the line and holding up this lead. Is what's your take? And I don't think they'll be able to come out of this hole. And I'm sure Coach is encouraging them to play to the final whistle. Then they can get out of here. And now, let's present our New Balance Player of the Game, Willie Hernan Gomez. He's kept a lot of their possessions alive with his work on the offensive glass. You can't measure what that kind of effort means to a team. Not just in terms of the second chances those rebounds create, but also for the example it sets. What a connection he has to these fans. They love him here. And the more he has games like this, the deeper that connection gets. And so the Lakers take the win. Some good competition, but the hometown advantage and their ability to stay focused, I think, made the difference.